Hello again, and this is another exciting tutorial by Phelps 3D. My name is Peter Phelps, and in this tutorial, we're going to make a very simple project from the Introduction to Solid Modeling using SolidWorks 2010. This is basically trying to use TreeCAD to do the projects that are in this book. The project we're going to do is a shaft, a really simple shaft. So we're in part design. I'm going to create this on the XZ plane sketch. And what we're basically going to do is starting from here, I'm going to draw a line straight across. Doesn't look like I'm on it, so I'll fix that later. Um, come up, go this way, up, this way, down. Okay, and make sure that that's. to the axes. Yep. Can I make my line? I want to make sure that that's straight up and down. Make sure that this one's straight up and down. So the length of the middle is 203.2. Seventy six point two plus two or three point two plus one or one point seven. So I'll set that at the bottom to that number. This one, it's from here to here is 101.6. This one should be the remainder, 76.2. This says it's redundant because, yeah, there is no other length it could be. Okay, and this should be... Now, the height of this part here is 9.525. This here, from here to here, is 
attention is 0 0.05. Fourteen point two eight seven five. Then we're going to play this corner here. Escape and I'm going to set the radius of that fillet to 6.25. There's not six here. Like, how can I get six point? I'm gonna flay it as big as I can. I don't know how they came up with six point two five. This is what one, two, three, four here. So the biggest you could do is probably three point seven five. See, yeah, if you go too far, it becomes invalid. Let's see, with this one, it said it's nine something. How can you? That's pretty much it. Then you go rotate, and something's not working. Something must not connect there. Another part design, validate sketch. Four missing. Fix invalid constraints. Now it's got redundant constraints, huh? And the four that it probably just created. <laughs> uh, I don't know why this is. I want to take a closer look.
axis intersects the sketch. There we go. Sorry. And so that created our shaft. <laughs> very simple, very easy little job to do. So that's about it on that one. I'm not going to go too much into it, but you get the idea. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.